Hello and welcome back to my channel. I am Lisa of Diamonds and Stitches and today, what is this? We're doing an unboxing of Diamond Art Club. Um, oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so excited. Um, Diamond Art Club, I got a new release. Did I get two new releases? We'll see when we get into the unboxing. Um, and also I'll have to link um, what I paid and when it was shipped and all of that jazz because I don't have that info at my fingertips. So, <laughs> um, yeah, still tight squeeze, getting ready for a garage sale and um, have stuff all over the place. So I don't even have my camera angle right and I apologize. Um, I'm in a bit of a uh, little bit of a hot mess right now. So <sighs> just go with um, all right, so need scissors, because again, bit of a hot mess, can't find anything. Um, so let's see what we got. Came packaged in this wonderful brown box. Let's see what my address is. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited, you guys. Okay, do you want to see what it is? I know you do. You're dying, right? It is Hope Runs Deep. Again, I don't remember um, who the artist, it's either Charles, I'll butcher it, I apologize. So that is what it is. Let's unbox it. I'm really excited about it. Okay, so this is a round shaped kit with a B's. It is a 76 by 56. And I have to tell you, it feels really heavy. Like maybe there's, seems like there's a lot of drills. Well, also it's kind of bottom heavy a little bit. Um, but Diamond Art Club, you guys, Diamond Art Club. Love their canvases. Love, love, love. All right, so let's open up the box. Inside the box, our canvas, which has Diamond Art Club and their logo, Do What Makes You Sparkle. Um, I think that there's a lot of drills in there, you guys. Yeah. Toolkit and the diamonds. The diamonds. Okay, so first off, if you are new to diamond painting and you have bought a kit from Diamond Art Club because you have heard from you other YouTubers in the diamond painting community say how much they love, love, love Diamond Art Club and their canvases and you went on and you ordered one, this is how it's going to come. You're going to get it in a nice, nice box. It's a really nice sturdy box. Um, and everything you need to start diamond painting is included in the kit, which is fantastic. Um, this one, they put, um, they have, I think now a square kit and a round kit um, bags before. I don't know that there was a distinction, um, but recently the ones that I've received have actually said that it's a round tool kit contents. So that's pretty awesome. It is in this nice, sturdy, poly, I don't know, it's a, it's a sturdier bag, which is nice, zipped, and inside it tells you that the contents are a magic applicator, a comfort grip, two wax pads, one craft tray, and one multiplicer. So now they're even telling you the multiplicer, or maybe they did before. What they're not telling you is that they also give you baggies. Um, okay, so magic applicator. This is your diamond painting pen. Comfort grip. And you put that on the end of your diamond painting pen or magic applicator. Actually, I don't think that this is a magic applicator. This, this was really difficult. Um, this is not the magic part. The magic part is the canvas. <laughs> 
and then it comes with a multi-placer. This is a three-placer, and you just put it on the other end of the pen where the hole is. So you've got one, one end has a single placer, and the other end is a multi-placer of a three-placer. You put three di diamonds on there, one diamond. It comes with these two cute heart waxes. My granddaughter loves these waxes. She always says when she sees them, oh, cute. <laughs> Maybe that's because I started that. I'm not sure. But um, I love these, though I've now been starting to put them into a pot. And um, and so I'm wrecking the heart shape. But it still makes me smile because I know that their heart's in this pot. It comes with some baggies. And these are for your overflow extra um, diamonds if you prefer to work out of baggies. I don't. Um, and so... These typically go away um, because I have a storage system. And then you receive a diamond painting um, tray or boat, as some people call it. This one is a clear plastic and it has a spout on it. Um, if you watch my channel, you know that I am a klutz and the spout and I are not friends. We, we don't get along. A spouty people. Mm -mm. And, um, but it's nice for, you know, those who it's, it's easy to kit up your diamonds when you can spout, pour them from the spout into your, your tray. Okay. Then you receive this awesome packet of diamonds. Um, this one says that it's DAC. I'm going to assume that that is the code for the painting so that they know it's being kitted up like that. And then um, that it has a B's. This one is round. Let me open this up really quick. Sorry for the noise. Or maybe lift that up. The girls aren't big, but yeah. Okay, so let's see what we've got here. Okay, wow, there are some pretty, pretty, pretty. All right, so what I love about Diamond Art Club is that they package everything in, oh my God, those are the ABs. Oh my gosh, those are pretty. I have not had pink ABs before. They're pretty, oh my God, I'm so cut off, sorry. Again, I told you guys, Angle, having some issues. <laughs> Um, anyways, they come in this nice long snake all put together. There's a couple of snakes and, um, but they have everything uh, almost, it depends on how many are in, like if there's a lot of like say black or white or a dark blue or whatever, like three tens, three, eight, twenty threes, um, that kind of thing, uh, B5200. If there's a ton of those, because that's a big background color, you might get three or four bags of those stuffed. Um, but typically everything will come in one, one package like this, which is nice. And, um, and so you can see, look at these. So on one side it says Diamond Art Club, it's got their logo, the whole deal. And then on the other side, it's got the color that is associated with um, the symbol on the chart. And so there, there's the ABs. Are they not pretty, you guys? Oh my God, they're so pretty. And then there's some purples and browns, orange, blues, the boring colors, some more purple. Um, this has a lot of, oh, there's a lot of different purples in this. Um, yeah. There's a lot of different purples, um, which is nice. So that's that one. Let's see if there's any other ABs. I would be very, very excited if there is. Um, oh, there's some dark colors. There is really a lot, a lot of purple. And here is some um, blues and teals. See these? Oh my gosh, they are so pretty. Look at those. There's a flesh color almost. Mm -hmm. and one more. Ooh. 
Yep, one more snake. Let's see. I think that there's only... <gasps> nope. There's another AB. I wonder if I missed it in the first snake. Um, There's some more ABs. We'll look when we get to the canvas, too. But, um... There's some oranges and some more dark colors. And look, guys, there's white ABs. Pretty. I want to say that there were three ABs in this one, if I recall correctly. And then just some, just some little, little, littles. Oh, here's the other one. Oh my gosh, you guys. It's orange. They're orange. See those ABs? So there are three three colors of ABs in this one. Pretty, 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 pretty. Okay, let's move that a little out of the warrant way, and then let's get into the canvas because that's what everyone likes to see, right? The canvas. All right, so Diamond Art Club has the nicest canvases. They have a velvet textured back to them, and Oh, you guys, the glue. I don't know what they're using, but I swear all the newer canvases have this horrific glue smell to them. Oh, okay. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. All right. So here's the magic. So you see it's all, it's all wound up, right? It's all wound up like this. Comes out of the box like that. Um, so what you do is you take this pretty canvas and you roll it the other way. And this is where the magic comes in. Oh, okay, you guys, I see the colors already. <laughs> it's so pretty. Um, so like I was saying, the back has um, a velvet kind of texture to it which is really nice. And it also helps make the canvas kind of pliable, which is also really awesome. Um, I don't know if it's because it was big that it was a little more difficult or what. And then the really cool thing, and you can't see it on camera, unfortunately, but the really cool thing about these canvases is that the symbols, the chart, the design on the canvas is sparkly. Do what makes you sparkle. It gives me joy. It just truly gives me joy to uh, work on these, on these canvases. Okay, so this has 49 colors in it. And let me double check -y. In DD Do, it does have three, three AB colors. Is that right? Because 154 and 155 are actual colors for, I think that's right. 154 and 155, I think are DMC colors. I think they are. Pretty sure. Could be wrong. If I am, I'll link that in my description. Okay, let's throw this baby out. Oh, okay, so I chose this. Uh, it does not have the artist name. You know what would be really cool is in the schematic up here, you know, where they've got like the information box. This one has that D, D, the Diamond Art Club um, model number, which is what corresponds, I think, with the kit um, diamonds, the little tab that was on that bag. And then it's got the name. Hope runs deep, and then the size 76 by 56. I would love, 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 if they would also put the artist name on here, um, because, yeah, truly, I would forget. I, I do forget. Okay, what's also really nice about Diamond Art Clubs, let me see if I can get you guys a little better angle without dropping my camera. I did that yesterday. And by camera, oh, by camera, I mean phone. Okay, you guys don't need to see me. You need to see the pretty canvas. Okay, there we go. So what's really cool about Diamond Art Club is that they put the um, color 
uh, schematic um, color, whatever you want to call it, on both sides of the canvas. So it is here in the upper left and then down here in the bottom right, which is, can you guys see that? Which is really, really nice because if you are working half-half on a canvas, do you guys see that? Um, when you are working half-half on a canvas, you know, so you have a light pad or whatever and you decide that you want to work and in this part is like flopped down over your drafting table or your light pad or whatever you're doing, you can see your schematic. And then you turn that sucker around and you're working on this part. Well, if it only had it over there and it's flopped over, you can't see it, um, you can work on it. Now, I dump this thing. Let's see. Did this come with it? Yeah. This is the first time I've gotten this. So um, it also came with a little sticker list and um, you can cut these out <clears throat> and place them on your storage so then you know um, you know what what your storage is and then you can cut out this does it have the cut see I would love somewhere in here there's space put the artist name artist name that would be awesome um, but then it gives you the picture. So there it is there in all its glory. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Oh my God, like seriously. And I love Christmas scenes. And um, oh, I'm just so excited. Okay, so, um, and as you guys all know, this is uh, the clear cover. Their canvases are just so stinking sticky. It's awesome. Um, there's a little deer right here. Oh my gosh. Okay, so let's get this up into the frame so you guys can see. I don't think you'll be able to see it sparkle. You guys see the sparkle on the canvas, but you can also see the drill field. It is clear, 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 clear. Like I don't need a light pad for this, which is wonderful because um, you know, I do have several light pads and, um, but with this one, the symbols are just so clear that there's no need for a light pad. Plus there's not a lot of dark area in here. And so, um, yeah, I don't need a light pad. Okay, you guys, let me get you into the camera. Oh my goodness. Um, let me get you into, so you can see this whole, I mean, the church that is in the center of this canvas is just gorgeous. Okay, so, Woo. see that church steeple? Oh my God, it's gorge, just gorge. Okay, this is probably the worst camera going around. Sorry guys. And then a little bit more, a little bit more. But see, this thing is huge, you know, and, um, oh my gosh, it's just gorgeous. Like, holy Hannah, this is gorgeous. It is almost the size of my coffee table. Um, it's beautiful, like beautiful. All right, let's, we are getting a bad glare too, aren't we guys? Sorry about that. Okay. Is that a little better? Yeah. Um, I'm half blind, so I can't really see what you guys are seeing. And if I put my glasses on, I get even a worse glare. So um, hopefully you guys get to see. And if not, I will have the link below um, for Diamond Art Club and this painting. I did not check to see if this one is sold out. Potentially it is. Um, I do know a lot of the new releases um, <clears throat> that were released the last little while. They were going fast, you guys. So, um, yeah, I love this painting. I wish I could remember the artist. I'm really sorry. I will probably put it along here um, as I, you know, edit. And then of course it will be in my description below. All right, um, thank you for joining me. If you are watching before July 28th, 2019, Please remember I have a giveaway and I will have that video linked in the description below as well. So if you would like to be entered for the giveaway, 
Um, there are two prizes, one for cross stitch and one for diamond painting. And um, it closes on July 28th at 11.59 PST. So if you are watching this video after that date, that contest has gone away, that giveaway is gone, and there could potentially be another one, who knows? Um, but um, please, if you'd like to be entered, uh, please go check out that video. So um, thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this unboxing and um, I will be back probably later um, this weekend, a couple of days, and I will be continuing on with my whips and sips. So, um, and then at some point I've got to finish a whip and sip, you guys. I need to finish one of those two kits that I kitted up just recently, the wolf dream catcher and the white roses and butterflies. One of those has got to be um, finished before I can even, even start this. Oh dear, oh dear. There's so many diamond paintings, so little time. Anyway, all right. I hope you all have a wonderful weekend and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.